I'm going to make a siphon to go in our aquaculture system that connects two fish ponds together so that if water is put in one pond, it flows over the rims of the two ponds into the next one. If you have a series of ponds in a river, you can add water to one end and it'll move through the ponds, one to the next, to the next, to the next. The siphons between the ponds look like this, an upside down U shape. And water will go up one side, across the top and into the next pond. The tube allows you to remove the air because it has to be full of water to work and have no air bubbles. To make the siphon, I cut three pieces of clear PVC pipe. The PVC pieces are attached to each other with flexible black plumbing fittings that are tightened with cable clamps. And the clamps are tightened until the siphon is airtight and watertight. When you put it into a fish pond, it's initially full of air and doesn't work. In order to make the siphon work, it has to be completely full of water to the top. I put a hole in the top tube at the very top and I insert a brass fitting into the hole that has a little nipple on the top for aquarium tubing. So that if you suck on the aquarium tubing, it pulls the air from the inside of the siphon out. And as you pull the air out, each pond rises up and fills it completely to the top with water. I put a little silicone around the brass fitting where it's screwed in to make sure that it's airtight. Then after the air is sucked out, I put a chopstick in the end of the aquarium tubing uh, to close it off. Most of the time, water is added to the ponds with rainwater collected from the roof. Rainwater from the roof comes to the pond through this tube. If we don't get enough rain, we add water from a faucet using a timer to add some water automatically each day. This pond gets nutrient-rich water from six aquaponics ponds connected by siphons. The pond water is used to irrigate and fertilize plants in the greenhouse. Pond water is pumped out through a hose for hand watering, for drip irrigation, or to a soaker hose. Connecting ponds with siphons over the top is easier than making holes in the sides of the ponds and installing tubes in between them. Siphons can be easily removed without damage to the ponds and makes rearranging the ponds easier. A siphon can easily be made longer to allow moving ponds to different spaces between ponds. Two siphons can be used between ponds to allow twice as much water to flow from one pond to another. Greenway siphons are an easy to make, super adaptive siphon for aquaponic systems. Aquaponic systems contribute to local food self-reliance. It's the Greenway. If you have any tips you'd like to share or questions you'd like to ask, please leave them in the comments below. And remember, subscribe, hit the bell icon, and give us a thumbs up. We'd really appreciate it. If you'd like to learn more about our sustainability research and support our work, click on our website button. Thanks for watching our video.